like you ever felt. Are you listening? Hello everyone. Today I will show you how to create a really quick and easy halftin effect as you can see. So we still have to go for something like this to something like that using a, a, a texture that I will make sure to put in the link from the description below along with the PSD file I will be using in this tutorial. Alright fantastic so let's get to it. Okay, so open in Adobe Photoshop and I still have my PSD still open so I will just save that by going to file save as and I will make sure like to uh, upload this PSD in the link from the description below where you can find all uh, the file and the texture I'll be using in this tutorial so we just close it and open uh, my image again like so and the first thing I will be doing is I will duplicate this first and then we need like to desaturate this uh, image so I will just press shift ctrl u this will desaturate it and as you can see uh, when we apply a half tone effect it will make it even darker than this so we need to brighten it a little bit so I will just make a level adjustment on it so I will press ctrl l and now I will bring this uh, middle in here one and I will uh, bring it into the left a little bit something like so all right it's okay now I will go to filter filter gallery and in the sketch folder in here just open it and you find a half turn pattern in here I will just make it size 1 and the contrast I will keep it 6 in here and I'll press ok as you can see it will uh, make it darker now I will uh, go uh, and choose adjustments in here and I will choose a threshold in here and now we can uh, control like the exposure of the white and the black as you can see so we just bring it down for something like 36 something like that and I will uh, bring the opacity down a little bit also so I will choose 70 percent and I will take this one in here I will duplicate it by pressing ctrl G and I will uh, make it in top in here and then I will change the blending mode to linear burn or I will choose color burn all right and now I will uh, make a snapshot so I'll press shift ctrl alt E this will create a merged layer in here now I will go and I will bring my texture in here so I will just take it drag it and open it so I will make it bigger a little bit press enter now I will take this one in here and I will bring it in top and I will change the blending mode to linear burn and as you can see it will create this really nice uh, blended with the texture now I will bring the texture again and I will press ctrl G and I will make it in top of everything and I will change the blending mode to linear burn again something like that now uh, we need like to create our layer mask so we we'll delete a little bit of the red in here so we we'll just uh, make a layer mask to it and then I will take a brush and I will just delete this part in here by a black color alright okay looks cool Now I will just merge everything by pressing shift ctrl alt e as you can see and the last thing I will do I will make a solid color to it so I will just go to this and I will choose solid color and I will choose this yellowish color this one in here and I will press ok now I will change the blending mode to exclusion and I will make the opacity 25% as you can see so this will give it this really nice uh, faded color to it and that's it so I hope that uh, you enjoyed this tutorial and it was a little bit helpful for you uh, don't forget to subscribe and comment and you know have a nice day thank you for watching